Okay, so here's what happened. Okay, so plants change originally. I was literally dressed like a grandma, like my my um the people in my hall were like calling me Gertrude and Ingrid because I was dressed to not be stressed, I guess. I was ready to go to bed. Me and this other guy were like, okay, you know what? Let's change and let's actually like go to this party. Like we were literally just gonna eat, go to bed, and then it ended up we're going to party. Everyone's going to a club after, but we won't go, right? Um, so, um, yeah, so I came to my room, I started putting makeup on, like, there was, like, 12 opportunities for me to not go out. Like, there was, like, 12, and then, like, while I was changing my outfits, I just had this overwhelming feeling that I should just stop. That I should just stop changing and um not go right I mean but I have that feeling all the time and then usually like it goes away and I'm like wow I'm so glad I went just I didn't want to go just because I was tired or lazy um I get changed I, th I feel like it took like 30 40 minutes um but it seemed like everyone else was still getting ready too it was just like all guys though and then we ended up taking like technically my sweet mate's car like from her boyfriend which is a whole other story but i'm pretty sure like whatever and i'll i don't know okay so then um, we get to the, the party part which is at like someone's like apartment we go there um it's pretty cool because there's like there's like dogs and like these two little kids running around so it's not like it's a pretty good environment and then, like, I introduced myself to, like, um, my co-workers that, like, I didn't know that it was their house, but, like, the person who parted it was, was Mike, that's my friend. And then, um, you know, there was just a lot of people who were like, you should just, you should come, like, you should come. So then, like, yeah, and Mike's girlfriend especially, like, you should come. Everyone was super nice. I tried to drink a gin and tonic. That was a mistake. I literally took one sip and I couldn't drink it. I put, uh, Nathan made it for me, and it was, I'm sure it would be fine, but I wanted to, like, throw up, so I don't think I can, like, drink for, like, a while. So then, um, fucking, let me see, uh, fucking, um, after that, Nathan basically... Okay, so I only saw Nathan drink, like, one solid drink, maybe two. So I poured my drink that I didn't like into his cup, and I think I saw him drink it, and he didn't put that much gin. But every bad story starts with gin and tonic for me, which is so funny. Anyways, so everything's chill. There's, like, this weird vibe, like, he starts getting, like, a little bit drunk, Nathan. He's, like... I don't want to say he's preventing me from talking to other people, but, like, he just keeps, like, talking and talking, and I'm, like, you know, I came to the party to, like, kind of talk to people I don't talk to, but I guess, like, we still don't know each other that well, so it's not, like, the worst in the world, but, like, okay, so this shit was fucking weird, okay, so he starts saying, like, he, so he's, like, you know, you're my homie. And then he, like, proceeds to be like, oh, you're my N-word. And then I was like, you know, like, I already discussed this with you, but you were drunk again. Like, you know, it's really disrespectful to, like, use that word, like, to me. Like, don't do it. And then he's like, oh, I'm so sorry. Like, I'm so sorry. So then, like, he, like, disappears or something. And then he comes back. Like, I don't actually see him, like, physically drinking anything. I see him with the same cup. And I'm pretty sure he did not change what was in the cup. Because I was talking to him the whole time. So I think I would have noticed. Um, but then he like disappeared for a little bit, I guess. He comes back and he's like, oh, um, he's like, oh, uh, I'm so drunk right now. I'm like, okay, he doesn't look that drunk. But um, he just starts talking about some shit. Like I mentioned like in the other in the previous video, I was like, oh, um, you know, you said something about like, 
he said like oh I'm not attracted to you and I just start laughing every time he says that because like who says stuff like that to anyone he's like oh yeah like we're like um like brother and sister like whatever and I was like that's fine like that's cool with me like he literally has a girlfriend and like we don't know like I, I don't know it's just weird so then like I'm just like whatever then it's time to, for people to go to the club so I originally said no this is this is the outfit I fucking have on I have this fucking like this is to like go to the mall or someone's house like I did it is not to go clubbing but guess what my ass decided to go clubbing and then when I decided to go there wasn't like that many seats fucking Nathan I was like oh well like if I'm going, it's like, oh, well, if Lavey and Virgo's are going, like, I'm going to go. So then I kind of was a little bit apprehensive about it, but, like, I was also a little bit tipsy. Like, I literally just had sips of champagne. I didn't even fully drink one. Um, so I definitely overdid it at the beer festival. Anyways, so, um, you know, he was, like, saying some weird stuff and, um whatever but then like we're like okay we're gonna go by the way <laughs> this other guy who was there like when I went on the singles retreat he was there he's like you get really crazy when you're drunk and he's like I don't think you should go to this club because it's really ratchet okay well he wasn't wrong and he was like I'm warning you it's gonna suck like I had like 20 warnings like not to go but I also had people like it's gonna be so fun like just go like you know I also had fucking work in four hours, which was, like, a mess. Um, but, yeah, so then I was like, okay, um, you know, um, let's go. So then we get in the car. Slowly things start, like, taking a turn. Okay, so Nathan is sitting next to me, and then I'm in the middle, and then it's another guy. So the whole time, Nathan starts taking shots of tequila that they have in the car. He starts to get, like, riled up. Like, he starts to have an attitude, and then he, like, keeps putting his hand, like, on my thigh, and he keeps, like, trying to hold my hand. And then, like, he starts, like, kind of, like, trying to kiss me, but, like, on the cheek and, like, the head and whatever. And then I'm just like, can you stop? And he's, like, kind of sleeping. And it got, and he was, like, getting, like, agitated, and it got to the point where I was, like, I was like, hey, um, <sighs> yeah, it got to the point where I was like, oh, hey, um, you know, hold on, <laughs> it got to the point where I was like, hey, um, are you okay, like, do you want to sleep in the car, because we were already, like, halfway to an hour trip from where we live um to this club and um we just like kept passing out and I was like oh my god then we finally make it to like right in front of the club but we're looking for parking Nathan does want to wait and makes us pull over so you can get out and pee they pull up pull over the car and they're like okay we're gonna find parking you guys go ahead to the club and they drive off then the other, then all three guys are like, oh, no, no, sorry, two out of the three guys that got out of the car with me were like, oh, um, they were like, oh, you know, that, um, they just left us, right, they just left us, and I was like, what the fuck, and I was like, no, they went to go park, why would they just leave us here, and then, um, we ended up walking there, like, Nathan is super drunk, like, can barely walk, and then, um, fucking, on the way to the club, he's, like, asking for cigars, he, like, needed to pee, like, all this stuff, we get to the club, surprisingly, like, him and one of the dudes go in, like, perfectly fine, and it costs, like, 8 euro, and I literally only had a 10 euro bill, because we decided not to go to the bank, because supposedly they take card, which was a fucking lie, um, and then, fucking, um, oh yeah, so then after that, 
Guys, what? Oh shit, I'm running out of time.